what the freak is up guys welcome back to my channel for those of you who are new my name is Cherie and here we have my brand new sim Michaela Vernon um, I initially made her for another project that I plan to do in the future but dream home decorator just came out today and I figured I would use her as our new interior designer so that's what we're gonna do I placed her in this little tiny starter home um, it's only her that's who we're starting out with <laughs> that's made that may be who we're finishing out with as well but I never had an LP where I'm just playing with one sim and I'm focusing on one sim so that's what we're gonna do in this one and she has this really cute tiny little starter home um, it's just her so she doesn't need anything too big so I just fell in love with this starter home it is so cute it's just so cozy um, I had to move her in right away so we're gonna get her started on her decorator career we're gonna find her a little job here we of course we're gonna make her a decorator um, we're trying out this new pack and I have to be honest like at first I was not excited about this new pack like at all but I figured let me try it out let me give it a chance so that's what we're doing today so we're going to have her select herself a gig here. Um, I'm not sure uh, which one we should go for. Um, there's a ton of gigs to choose from here. Um, so let's just see which ones we can do. I know some, of, some gigs you have to be at a certain level to do. So we're going to just pick one that's at the beginner level because that's where we're at right now so see what we can find they have bathroom additions and residential living room walk-in closet kids room bedroom renovations level additions uh fabulous living room renovation i mean it's just a ton of renovations you can do but i think we found ourselves a card um i think we found ourselves a gig a memory card has been added to our inventory to use there it is right there um i think that's for us to take photos of our before and afters so um i wanted to change her aspirations i don't know if we got anything new um far as aspirations for interior designer i don't think we did but let me just check really quick yeah i don't i don't i'm not seeing anything nothing's really jumping out at me far as a new aspiration So I guess I'll just pick like a random one if we if there's no nothing new as far as aspirations are concerned. But I did want to change that, so that's why we are here. Yeah, I am not seeing anything any different than before, so I take it that there's no new aspirations, which is fine. I mean, we can always um, choose something else, but that's not going to be our forefront of what we want to do, because um, we're really trying to jump into this design career. I guess we'll just pick, I don't know, I can't decide exactly what I want her aspiration to be, um, I 
guess I'll just do renaissance sound because that's like a little bit of everything but wow look at all this over here interior color consultant it looks like the gig starts at 9 a.m tomorrow and it is 9 p.m sunday night so we're just going to probably send her off to bed so she can get a good night's sleep and be ready for her day in the morning because she got a lot of tasks that she has to complete. I'm a little nervous about doing all this, but we'll see how it goes. I always make a mistake and grab the rug. I do it every single time. Oh, look at that little kitty out there. Is that a cat or a dog? Maybe Michaela will get a pet. Oh, look at me. I'm trying to pick up strays and he ran away. I'm glad he ran away because next thing you know, I would have had like a new pet. <laughs> I'm good for picking up like strays and stuff. I just love animals. Alright, so she's up already. It's 4.30 a.m. We did head to bed kind of early, but I am like ready to start this decorator career ready to jump into it we're gonna get her some breakfast to get her started for her day um let's get her going i love this little tiny home it's like perfect for her she could come sit out and eat her breakfast Oh, uh, this place is really cute though. Like for my first tiny home, I think this place is like so perfect for her. Yeah, we're just gonna start off with eating some cereal. I just had her eat some cereal because like who has time for doing all that cooking? Um, I don't want her to burn the house down in the first episode already <laughs> so I just want to turn the autonomy back on um, I had it off because I was recording Sulani Love Island so let's kick that back on real quick now let's just have her get ready for her day so she can be the best she can be I'm like looking for the shower here. It's like stuck up on the wall there. <laughs> oh, there's that little kitty again. I'm not gonna worry. I'm not gonna go chasing stray cats down the street. <laughs> come on, girl. Come in here and get your shower. Oh, she's showering with her clothes on. That's great. I'm going to have to fix that later. They don't usually do that. My sims don't usually shower with clothes on. I wonder why they're doing it now. Uh, but I think it's easily fixable if I just run like a batch fix. So I'm going to try to do that. Oh, I can't wait to start decorating. I am excited to decorate. I was not excited when I first heard about this pack, though, I must say. But now that we're here, I'm feeling it. I'm ready to start decorating. The only thing that concerns me is, like, I'm very indecisive when it comes to, like, decorating and stuff like that. So it takes me quite a while to design. Like, it takes me a while to decorate. Oh, here we go with the likes and dislikes. Yes, she likes fitness. She likes it. Aw, oh, this is cute. Like, she's sitting in a little rocking chair. I don't even know if I've ever seen them sit in the rocking chair before, but this is cute. Ah, oh, I like this little animation. Uh-huh. Feeds through the floor, but it's fine. <laughs> oh, that's cute. 
she has no like electronics in this house and that ain't gonna work for us we need electronics baby give me a radio give me a tv like i need electronics in my life <laughs> who doesn't like come on let's give her like a rate Ooh, look at all the little retro radios i forgot i downloaded all this stuff let's get her one of these little retro stereo radios here so cute oh, where is it oh there it is can we put it on the coffee table please Maybe, okay we can put it up there All right, we could place it up on the counter, but I really wanted to place it over here on the coffee table if we can. That's cute little retro video. Is it really sitting on the table? doesn't look like it's completely sitting on the table but let's turn it on right now give her a little something else to do besides rocking in her little chair here <laughs> she's like a little lady sitting here rocking in her rocking chair till time for work <laughs> oh no it's not it's not even on the table <laughs> Alright, let's place that down. Hopefully that is on the table now. But we is it's quickly approaching time to go to work, so I am so ready to get there. Michaela has a decorator gig in one hour. Get to the clients lot on time and chat with them about what they're looking for before starting renovations we sure will ah i wish we just get there already i love her place it is so cute Who's that? Oh no, we're not gonna do that. We gotta go to work. No time, no time to be talking to boys right now. <laughs> All right, she's off. And we have made it to our first decorator gig. Look at her, she's so cute in her little outfit. She's cute. So we're gonna just knock up. I think it's over here is where we need to be. Okay, so let's go introduce ourselves to the client. Look at her standing there with her little swatches in her hand. So cute. Taking before and after photos to document your work as interior decorator is important. Um, no, we don't want to do these little lessons here. Nah. We can figure it out on our own. So we're going to just get to know the client. Um, we're just going to go down this gig task list and check everything off. Do everything we can. Discuss designs. Oh, she's cute. And we're just gonna try to learn as much as we can about what they want and what their likes and dislikes. Ask about favorite designs. Ask to see inspirations. Oh, 
Ah, she got her little swatches in her hand. That's so cute. Asked to see some chess board. Oh, look at that. That's cute. Discuss designs. So I just want to like, okay, so I guess they like the color blue here and they dislike the color red. You can see right over here in this little panel area here, their likes and dislikes and what they want. Dislikes basic, basic decor, basics de decor. I don't know, that's hard to say. Uh, Fezco is calling. That's my Fezco sound. For those of you Euphoria fans, Fezco's calling. That was her first friend that she made. <laughs> that's so cute. Maybe, who knows, later on in this uh, LP here, maybe we'll, like, you know, go on a little date with Fez Fezco. Who knows? So, oh, now I don't think we could take a good before or my before and after pictures are gonna suck. Like, I don't, I can't take good pictures. <laughs> like, it doesn't give you like a good angle. If anybody knows how to take like better angle, she says she's scared. Um, no, we're not gonna be doing any like haunted stuff going on. Why is she scared? That's weird. Alright, let's try to get a nice before and after shot. I think this is the room that they want us to redecorate. I mean, there's not much except this room and, like, the kitchen and the bathroom. So, we're just going to get a couple shots here. Get a shot of the living room area. Uh, I'm not sure if they're going to want us to do the whole space. I guess they will. Like, I don't know. Okay, we got some before shots. Uh, hopefully, we got enough shots of what we need. So I believe we have to send the client away before we start our renovation. So that's what we're going to do. And I am going to speed up this renovation part because like I said, I will probably take me quite a while to figure out how I want to design this. So I will see you guys after I renovate this space. Hey guys, we are back, and like I said before, this is uh, took me a while to get my uh, design going here. Um, it took me at least an hour to do this, 
but we are here and everything is redesigned um but you guys gotta let me know how you want me to do this like do you want me to record um me actually renovating the place it, it the videos are gonna be actually so much longer if i do it that way but you guys can let me know down in the comments whether you want to see all of that or should we just go straight to the reveal um you know it's up to you guys what you want to see but i did i did have to cut the renovation part way down because it took me so long so here we're just taking the after shots here and i'm almost ready to call the clients back to the house but this is what we have um you saw what we had before this is what we got now i think it looks a whole lot better you know the client likes blue the color blue so i tried to make sure i incorporated that a lot without going over their budget um but yeah we're gonna call the client back soon i'm a little nervous to see if they're gonna like it or not we will see um but yeah i think everything looks good within their budget like i could have went ham um i think it's i don't know if it's okay if you go over budget um, I don't know if like how much you can go over budget. I don't know if that's like a good or a bad thing Probably depending on if they like it. It might be a good thing, but I didn't go too much over the budget which was like I think like 8,000 or somewhere around there something like that so I didn't want to go too far over budget. I think I only went like five bucks over budget so yeah i didn't go too far but i made sure i incorporated a lot of blues a lot of different color blues um and i didn't have any red because uh the client didn't like red so i made sure i didn't have any of that um yeah but i think all in all turned out pretty good so i think we're ready to call our client back and see um what they think okay let's get them on the phone here so we can see what they think of our design i don't know i'm a little nervous to see what they're gonna think of it hopefully they like it um but how do i call them back is the question okay so you just click on your sim and it and you can call your clients back to the house and now i have to select the before and after photos which my before and after photos i don't think i really got that great that good of shots i think i'm gonna have to get better at taking the before and after photos but i'm just like clicking all of them <laughs> know like what do you want how many do I don't know how many we get to select or any of that so I'm just gonna click randomly here not enough uh, how many do we have to do all of them some of them um, okay So we did that and they should be coming back. She, oh, okay, she's calling them now. Do you want to personally show off your renovated space to the clients? Yes, I do. Here they are, they're back. <laughs> so cute. They look nervous, look at her. <laughs> That's so cute. They actually look nervous. So what do we have to do here? Reveal renovated space. Show off objects. Chat with clients. Ask client for their final verdict. All right. Let's do it. Oh, look. They're covering their eyes. That's so cute. 
Okay, let's get a good angle for when they walk in. <laughs> this is so cute though. Uh, I think I mean so far I'm I'm enjoying this I mean I'm enjoying this this pack I feel like I'm gonna have to get a little better at managing my renovation time but other than that I think yeah it's cute I like it there's a little before and after shots going on it's so cute Yeah, I'm gonna have to get better at the before and after, but yeah, I think it's cute. Come on in. Why are we standing in the hall, guys? Okay, so you can have them like if you click on it, you can have them check out different items. That's so cute. Lots of blue going on. We love the blue. We don't like cheap items. Like, I tried to make sure I didn't give them, like, uh, you know, too much, too expensive items. Because, you know, we got to stay within budget. But I did upgrade um, their um, furniture a lot. Like, more expensive pieces than what they had. They're checking it out. They're checking it out. Oh, she's nervous. She's like, oh, I hope they like it. So I guess they're when they're done checking it out, I'm ready to talk about the renovation. Okay. Ask for the final verdict. Let's get their final verdict. Oh, they're crying. <laughs> That's so cute. Ah, <laughs> he's hugging her. That's cute. I think that means they like it. I don't think they would be hugging if they didn't like it. Uh -huh. They look happy. Oh, they're hugging. Yay. Michaela has completed the gig and received the following. Her money earned 650 bucks and professional reputation improved significantly. Wow. So I guess that is the end of this episode. And I'm enjoying this so far, guys. So please give it a like if you enjoyed this episode. And yeah, and I'll see you in the next one.